Okay, so I see a lot of people struggling with double wall jumps and late jumps. So that's what we're going to be going over this video. One, two, three, four. Okay, so first we're going to practice double wall jumps. This pillar right here is absolutely perfect for double wall jumps. So what you're going to do is you're going to start your wall run just right here in between the wood and the metal. And then you're going to jump off immediately after the pillar. So it's, it sounds kind of weird, but jumping after the pillar is what makes a double wall jump a double wall jump. And it makes you go super, super high. It should look something like this. After you do the double wall jump, you should be able to make it up to this platform right here. By the way, you don't need to start your wall run immediately right here. It could be over here. It could be over here. Just keep it close to the edge. Okay, late jumps. Late jumps are useful for only a few shortcuts, but it's definitely a good thing to know. So with late jumps, what's going to happen is you're going to start your wall run like you normally would. Come over here, and then you're, you're going to jump after the wall ends. You know you've done a late jump whenever you can move around freely in the air. It should look something like this. And I can move freely around in the air. Rather than normal wall jumps, where I'm kind of stuck to one place. Ooh, something I forgot to mention. I don't know what the name for these type of wall jumps are. But I, I recently learned about this just on my own. I've seen people do it on... Um, Perseverance, which is course six over there. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to jump into the wall and then you're going to double click your jump button as soon as you hear the little wall run sound. And then as soon as you jump, you're going to pull back on your movement stick. Should look something like this. And Bruh. you'll be going a lot higher. It's kind of difficult to do. You need to get the right angle. But yeah, thank you for watching, and I hope this brings you closer to getting S+, or just a new personal best. See you.